What's going on guys? What is going on? Got a little teaser here for AGA Token Project we've been talking about for a very long time since their original pre-sale. Then of course when they started doing LP pools and we're earning yield and they're making all this money on mining. Okay, so let's recap here. Here's a little sneak peek that I got here. Everything on here is technically unofficial, so don't hold the word to it, but there is some exciting things. First of all, this looks like their website and it looks very sleek. But Here's a couple things. No minimum AGA token stake to qualify for rewards. Now, in order for that to be a reality, then they need to have a layer two scaling solution for Ethereum or move to a new chain altogether. Maybe both. Liquidity price stability supported by cryptocurrency mining. We already know that AGA right now is currently earning something like over $100,000 per month in profit used for AGA buybacks, marketing, partners, uh, expansions in yield which we'll talk about here in a second things are getting very exciting I'm gonna say it right here now at the beginning I'm gonna say it at the end buy at least 2,000 AGA swap half of them for AGAR so you have a thousand AGA and a thousand AGAR in terms of the dollar value there and then put them in an LP and start earning bi-weekly rewards the valuation for AGA is laughable if you're looking in terms of PE ratios for traditional finance, and then you put the component of crypto on there, it should be a multiple of that. AGA should be $10, and AGR should be $1,000 based on the mining capacity of the AGA project. Now, why do I think it's even more laughable? Because the partnership they just announced that we'll get to means they're going to be making even more revenues for AGA buybacks and dividends. Let's keep looking here, though. Fun fact, you can be a governance member for 10000 AGA. You don't pay 10000 just if you have 10000 in your wallet or in a LP. AGA platform has 200 plus Bitcoin miners. AGA monthly reward is $100,000 plus dollars in profits. Not revenue, profits. But here's the interesting part. Oh, what's this? Partners. What's miner? Okay, maybe that's where they've got their miners from. So that's nothing new, nothing too exciting. This is exciting. Polygon. Polygon is formally Matic, and guess what? Is a layer two solution for Ethereum. Guess what Polygon also has on their network? Quick Swap. Quick Swap is like Pancake Swap, Uniswap, except runs on Polygon's poor protocol. Well, they're listed as a partner, and to my knowledge, there has been no official announcement of any kind of integration of AGA and AGAR onto Quick Swap or Polygon. You're getting in before the news here, guys. Now. Quick Swap also is probably going to do IFOs or IDOs just like Pancake. You think it's possible that AGA might be one of their first sales on there? Do you think that brings any new investors? Do you think that brings any new hype, price appreciation, more AGAR going to need to be bought off the market in order to pair with that AGA, right? There's only 16,000 AGAR to go around. There's only something like 6 million AGA to go around. Let's do some math here. This one's interesting. Ferrum Network. Now this one they just announced today. Here it is. Ferrum Network and AGA and Token Partnership Expansion. So we do know that AGA has used Ferrum Network's staking capabilities on their Unifier wallet. But what are they doing here? By partnering with Ferrum Network and taking a position in FRM, we now have substantial allocations in the early stage investment opportunities introduced by Ferrum, such as BSC View and Network. Ferrum, if you don't know, if you hold 50,000 FRM or more, you get access to pre-sales. All of these pre-sales historically have 10x to 50x in value already, and they're all still brand new. On top of that, Ferrum does pay out up to a 30% APY on a monthly basis to its holders. Sometimes you gotta play chess when everybody else is playing checkers. AGA appears to be leveraging the $110,000 in monthly profits to then diversify their treasury and participate in other yield opportunities. So although their main focus is Bitcoin and Ethereum mining profitability, you don't want to be stuck with only that as your revenue driver. They're going to parlay a couple weeks of mining revenues to go buy, I don't know what they bought, 50,000 FRM, 100,000, 150,000 FRM, which is now going to produce 30% yield and give you pre-sale access. You can start seeing what they're doing here. They're going to stack yield upon yield upon yield, take profits out of the yield, and that increases the buybacks 
of AGA. It also makes the 24% DeFi APY to LPs sustainable indefinitely. Man, this is looking good. These investments will, in turn, allow us to buy back more AGA and ultimately grow the AGA community. Moreover, this port partnership is part of a greater strategy where AGA will partner with similar launch pads and incubators in order to take advantage of the tremendous upside presented by pre-sale opportunities for the benefit of our project and our token holder. Did you hear what they said there? We'll partner with similar launch pads and incubators. Maybe that's where Polygon comes into play. Maybe that's where QuickSwap comes into play. But there's one more partner here. Does that look familiar? That is LearnCrypto.io. That is me and Todd. Why? Because we're going to be part of the, we're already part of the governance, but we're going to be official partners as part of the research for what AGA is doing. They're kind of, they're calling it the AGA evolution. Now they're going to take these mining profitabilities and research and get into early opportunities in crypto that all produce passive income, almost becoming a crypto fund. And how do you participate in the fund? If you don't have enough money on your own to get into FRM pre-sales, if you don't have enough knowledge to set up uh, different trades like we do in our Discord group, you can simply get AGA, AGAR, set up an LP, earn your dividends, and reap the benefits of other people with more capital and knowledge taking advantage of the cyclical opportunities in the crypto market. I've been telling you guys to buy AGA since it was 18 cents. I told you again at a dollar. Now we are over two dollars. And I'm telling you right now, even on this run up, stop dragging your feet, stop thinking about it. Simply buy at least 2,000 AGA, swap half of them to AGAR, and set up the LP and forget about it. Watch the rewards hit every two weeks, and we'll see if that reward structure changes a little bit as we have new uh, layer two solutions, whether it's Polygon, which is obviously listed. If you do notice, B BSC has been mentioned. If you check out the treasury address of AGA token, guess what else they own? They own cake in their treasury. Now, why would they do that? Well, maybe they're gonna get on pancake swap. Maybe they're gonna have an IFO there. Maybe they're gonna become partners there. We'll see. Now they also have SXP swipe in their treasury. Now, why would they do that? Why would they do that? Well, Swipe is supposed to be launching their AMM, their Automatic Market Maker, this Friday, similar to Pancake. And it's supposed to be both for BSC and for ERC-20. Maybe a built-in bridge where you can bridge your AGA all in one app. Sure seems like Tomas and the people involved with AGA are playing chess right now. And they are winning without people even knowing. Understand that AGA is now all the way to over $2 and AJR is pushing $150 with a community of 2,000 people. When you have tokens like AGA that you have 6 million of them, that's it. AJR is 16,000 of them, that's it. What happens when the community grows to 5,000 or 10,000 and everybody's just simply locking up their tokens and, and trusting that the mining profitability sustains itself, the research and FRM and pre-sales and whatever else may move forward continues? Price can only go one way. A prime example is FRMX. Their partner has a value of something like five or six thousand dollars per FRMX. Guess how many FRMX there are? Something like thirty-two thousand. Double that of AGAR, and has a value of six thousand dollars per token. Roadmap looks interesting. They already met all the roadmap quarter one goals. Quarter two, oh, Binance Smart Chain launch. Refer a friend program and community development in Asia. Those all sound pretty good to me. Q3, major mining expansion. Now, how do you expand your mining facility? Yeah, you can use the 100,000 of profits you're, you're making, but those are supposed to be for buybacks and other investments. How do you do that? Well, I think you use Polygon or you use QuickSwap. You have an IFO or an IDO or an ILO or whatever they're talking about. You raise some funds, you take half of those funds or all those funds to go buy more miners increasing your mining profitability by nearly double. So instead of making 100,000 per month, you're making 200,000 profits. You see how this could easily scale? Hmm, this is very interesting. And then 2021 Q4, major exchange listing. Obviously, uh, centralized exchange is always a benefit uh, as many people still don't use DEXs. Now I'm hoping that Uniswap, QuickSwap, maybe Pancake, maybe SwipeSwap, and then maybe you can get on a couple, a smaller exchange. Maybe you can get on Barter Trade. Oh, does somebody know Barter Trade? 
Maybe the person doing the video does. Maybe that's why Lone Crypto is also a partner there. You don't believe, you're just like, Nick, you're saying numbers, but how do I know they're making it? Well, here's their dashboard. Here's all the miners they have. Here's their monthly profit, not revenue. So for batch one, batch two, batch three, monthly profit. What's that sum down there? $141,607 in monthly profit at current Ethereum and Bitcoin prices. All to be used for AGA buybacks, marketing, partnerships, diversifying the treasury, and other votes that the governance may have. Any ideas? They have the funds, and they're going to use them. And whether you would listen to me at 18 cents, or you listen to me at a dollar, or now you want to listen to me now at two dollars, I think this is just the beginning for AGA. Like I said, at current mining structure, you should be looking at a $10 AGA and a $1,000 AGAR. Now, if they do a raise with Polygon, and they raise a million bucks, and they double this mining facility, all bets are off. The PE ratio changes greatly. The possible valuation based on their holdings and their mining hash power doubles. All while you earn 24% APY for being an LP on Uniswap. Maybe soon to be Polygon. Maybe soon to be PancakeSwap. That's all I got to say, guys. I had to do a video because me writing in the Discord obviously isn't pushing you guys to stop dragging your feet. People are making generational wealth while you sit there and think it's too complicated. It is not complicated. I'll even bring it over here for you. Here you go. You go to Uniswap. You find the token. Here is their contract address, 94E20. Here is AGA. You can trade it. Once you have AGA, you can swap half to AGAR. The payer is right here. Once you have at least 888 AGA and the equal dollar amount in AGAR, you simply click add liquidity, you hit max on AGA, you hit send, you pay an Ethereum transaction fee, and that's it. And two weeks from now, you will be receiving dividends. All while AGA continues to pump out the profits, continues to increase their treasury position, and continues to buy back AGA.